With its bold angular lines and swing up doors, the remarkable Lamborghini Countach 5000S is often called the stealth fighter of sports cars. Right from its 1971 debut, this car has been a standout and no other manufacturer has ever quite matched this Lamborghini's fresh styling. Even early versions would rocket to 60 miles per hour in less than five seconds. And a top speed near 190 miles per hour was all in a day's work for this amazing aluminum bodied supercar. In 1988, Lamborghini celebrated its 25th anniversary by producing a limited number of Countach models, including some with an advanced 48 valve engine. Still turning heads and making pulses race, few rivals can match its speed and handling. Even Lamborghini's elegant and striking Diablo seems restrained by comparison. Supercars may come and go, but there'll never be another Countach. It seems a long way from tractors to supercars. But that's the route Ferruccio Lamborghini took when he decided in 1962 that it was time for someone to build a better sports car than Ferrari. Many experts concede that the tractor builder did a pretty good job with his automobiles. And few would deny that some of the most stunning cars of the past 30 years have emerged from the Lamborghini factory. From the earliest sports coupe to the current Diablo models, Lamborghinis have always been remarkable automobiles with sensational levels of performance. The 1967 Mura was staggeringly beautiful, technically advanced, and remains amazingly fast despite the passing years, thus retaining its sought-after status at classic car auctions. The 1974 Countach placed Lamborghini firmly among supercar trendsetters with its brash and revolutionary styling, which turns heads even today. The current Diablo, sold as coupe or roadster, continues this love of automotive drama, and future Lamborghinis will reflect the legacy of creative innovation. Lamborghini inspires, rather than copies, other automakers.